hello guys welcome to how to fix stack in this video guys if i want to run this media creation tool and want to upgrade into the windows 10 so i'm getting the this error we are not sure what happened and the error code is this one okay so if you are upgrading to windows 10 you might be getting this error as well okay so how to troubleshoot this issue so first of all i should tell you why you are facing this issue so first of all two protocols are disabled by default in windows 7 so that's why you are getting this issue so in order to fix this issue we have to enable some registries so there is some quick fix from the microsoft so we need to click on here ok ok and just leave it media creation tool here open the google chrome once you open the google chrome you need to write here this terms only I will give its link into my description box you just need to copy here and write here update to enable LTS 1.1 and LTS 1.2 this is inbuilt default disabled in Windows 7 so we need to enable this and we will get the registry patch from the Microsoft to enable this service both protocol ok once you write here you can see the first link you will see the from the Microsoft just open the first link so these are the two links we need to this one is for latest update if your window 7 is not updated this patch will update your window and this link will enable the protocol LTLS 1.1 and LTS 1.2 Okay, once you open this website from the Microsoft, just you need to scroll down. And just scroll down. You will see here registry information. And you can see also it is written here. And you need to click on this tool, easy fix, click on that and once you click on that you just need to scroll down a little bit and here is the setting you need to enable here you can also manually go through this and create the registry key like this but Microsoft has provided us the shortcut and enable this option you can see here you will see here eg fix and then click on automatically click on this option and once you click on this option it will redirect you to download and it will automatically be downloaded you can see it is downloaded okay so this is the first step to download this in order to enable the registry editor two protocols as I already told you that and the second one this website this is the link of the Microsoft just paste it here and you will get here the latest windows patch ok so once you open the page you will see here the the last one this one is for 32 bit and this one is for 64 bit so in order to check the operating system bit open the computer and we need to right click here in the computer and go to its properties and once we go to properties you can see system type in my case it is 32 bit but in your case it should be 64 bit or 32 bit so you, you need to choose the accordingly if you got here the 64 bit you need to download this patch the second last and if you have 32 bit you need to choose last option so once you have got the knowledge you have 64 bit or 32 bit operating systems so you need to go here and then click on download option in my case I have 32 bit so I'm choosing here this option last one if we have 64 you need to choose the second last option so click on here and again we need to click on here this link and let me maximize this Now you can see 
it is downloaded now so now we need to go to here let me cut it from here and let me cut this as well let me paste it here so these two software has been pasted here so first of all we need to enable the registry editor so we need to right click here this key and then click on install and then click on run and it's going to install agree next this will enable the protocol which is default disabled in Windows 7 and 8 you need to select here yes so as you can see all done here you need to close this and now it's time to run the latest windows so before that you can also check for update on your windows operating system open the control panel go to view by select here the large icons once you select here the large icons we need to go to here windows update this option okay you can see make sure you turn on this option automatic update okay and also you need to check for latest windows from here as well if any kind of error you are getting while you are running this so before that you can also run it if it is already latest window in your here but in my case you can see it is getting some error so we need to close this so we can close this and we, we can directly run this tool to get the latest windows in the windows 7 now it is searching for latest updates here you can see you just need to wait here yes now it is going to download the latest windows just need to wait here initialization installation is done and it is going to download the latest package okay this is also done you must restart your system now since we have enabled the registry as well as the latest windows restart now okay so you must have restarted your system now and now you need to right click on the media creation tool and run it as administrator now click on yes and if you don't know how to install the media creation tool go to search bar here I mean the Google and simply type their media creation tool and go to the official link of the Microsoft Windows 10 download now go to first link of the Microsoft in order to get the media creation tool and now once you launch this you can see download now this is the media creation tool just download it okay so you need to right click on this option guys and just keep your personal finance data and after that your windows 10 is going to install easily okay so hope this video useful for you guys if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech